What's going on, Turf Team? It's Route Combo, aka the Professor on the Sticks, and I have not posted a video on this channel or my main channel at Route Combo in quite a minute. So I've been playing a lot of Madden lately. And just as a little side note, you see that Ray Charles read that's <laughs> Kilo's tag, and that is an amazing, an amazing uh, gamer tag. I low key want to steal that from him one day. Or not steal it, you know, borrow it, make maybe take it from, him, pay him off on it. But Ray Charles Ray is that just fits in so well with Madden. But anyways, what I'm doing on offense right here, I'm on in pistol wide trips and or pistol trips. And the reason why I'm gonna be running this formation all game long. The game you're seeing is that it's currently a lab game. So what we did and why I'm running it in the entire game was so I went into the lab, found a formation because on the MaddenTips.tv, I'll leave a link in the description below. There's over 25 hours, probably close to 30 hours now of maybe even more than that, of videos with different money plays, schemes, concepts, like re how to uh, red zone concepts, um, all sorts of different stuff. Over 25, probably 30 hours of, of, of video. So it's like you can get access to all of it. It's like seven, eight bucks a month, something like that. So if you want, you can uh, purchase that. And especially if you do like draft champions, there's a lot of different... Uh, you don't get to pick your playbook, so it, it's harder to have a scheme, and you don't want to just go into a, into a game and just run inside zone and four verticals like a lot of these bums do. You need to have a little different scheme. So this is a really good way to be able to have a lot of different formations and different plays um, that that's in the game. Because there's a lot of great formations in the game that aren't widely used just because everyone sticks with some of the most popular concepts and not sort of concepts, but formations and plays. And anyway, so what we did at the turf team, we we decided to make a custom book. So everyone like Shugs, Kilo, CC, me, we all broke down a formation, any formation in the game we wanted. Uh, I decided to go to pistol because no one did pistol at the time. And so I, I, this is the formation I broke down. So what you're watching here is a lab game of me kind of putting it all together. And I think I did pretty good on offense myself. So if, if you want to check it out, you can definitely do that. But let's break down the gameplay here. It's seven seven. Almost getting to halftime. Now it's 10 to 7. I'm down. So I'm going to have to be throwing some dots. Hit him up in the flats. Able to drag a defender all the way to make it third and two. Hit him with a nice little die play. Inside run to get the first down, which is really, really key because there, there's nothing worse. I, I cannot stand fourth and ones. Like fourth, third, fourth and ones are like the absolute worst. So I, I'm glad I was able to convert there, especially being down. With only 40 seconds left till half. Look at Tom Brady. That <laughs> I don't even think he can rent, run a sub-5, five, uh, 540, but he got the job done, got five yards, was able to move the chains. What's very nice about this formation is uh, you have a lot of basic, really great concepts, and you have some good runs as well. And out of the pistol formation, there are some blitzes out there that the pistol, like especially some ed edge blitzes, if you're in, Shotgun, they come on, they come off the edges perfectly fine. But if you're in pistol, sometimes they don't come in. So uh, that's one reason why I like pistol. A lot of people sleep on pistol this year, so that's an, another reason. It has some really good runs as well. So, and, I, and there's a different thing how I motion out the running back to make a really nice flood concept, beats both man and zone coverage. But let's break this down here into the third quarter. Third and ten. I just want to make sure you get some yards to make it fourth and manageable. I don't like fourth and tens, but I like fourth and fives. So come with the concept. I read the I read the right side of the field. It looked like man coverage, and that yellow zone was a little too far away. So I was able to thread the needle, pick up the first down. Once again, you see my opponent is just blitzing the crib here. It's it's kind of funny. A lot of people, especially after new patches come out and stuff like that, they don't they some of their blitzes are gone, so they resort to just engage eight or. <laughs> Or uh, just play two man under. I don't know. It's it's, it's just crazy. But like I'm not if I, if I don't have a scheme or any sort of scheme at all. Like I don't necessarily think going into a game not having a scheme is uh, is the way to go. But I was down 10-7 in the second quarter. And now I'm up 21 to 10, and he just tried to chunk up some garbage and aggressive catch me, which I'm glad the game didn't pay. Let him uh, catch that at all. So I'm up 21-10 with the ball. My offense is really moving. My running back is just fighting for yards to get that first down. Now I do a little play action, uh, wide receiver screen pass. Was able to get a nice little few yards there. Could have gone for for more and almost got intercepted as well. But um, once once that the guy missed that interception, I thought I was going to get a big gain out of it. But he held me to a pretty minimal gain. Once again, fourth and two. I hate this area, like I told y'all. Dot. 
He blitzed crib right there. I think he should have. With two yards, I mean, I don't think a lot of people are going to run the ball unless they're in like a like an inside zone type of run. But even then, you can blow that up, user. I don't, I don't like really like running the ball on fourth and two. So he did an all-out blitz, which really helped me out. And I dive into the end zone to go up twenty-eight to ten. That is pretty much going to wrap up the game. I'm, I'm going to start sending some some screamers, send a little B gap. That time he blocked crib and just trying to aggressive catch me. I was able to tap X multiple times and have defensive assist kind of help me out with knocking out the uh, the ball there. So he punched the he punched the rock. I'm not really too sure why. I mean, I guess he's conceding the game as well and being a being a uh, a sim player. News news flashed obviously sim players. So there's no such thing as a sim Madden player. We're taking it to the crib. So 35 to 10. I just have to showboat a little bit there. <laughs> I usually try not to do that. I hate when people showboat. But anyways, 35 to 10 with the two-minute warning. Get another another screamer. Come in through the B gap for a sack. That's pretty much going to do it, guys. We're going to finish out the game for the fun of it. So I think there's one or two more possessions. Fourth and 20. Nothing doing. So uh, let's let's try to score one more time. I'm, uh, I should be clocking them out a little bit. I, might, I need to put two clock on. I don't know why I didn't do that. And that was a terrible run stick by me. Once again, another fourth and inches. This game really, like, you'll see the stats at the end. Like, I, oh, look at that. Get past the first down marker, and I get hit back where my forward of progress stopped, but Madden didn't give me the first down. Unbelievable. Those are little things. Like, come on, Madden. You're better than that. Maybe maybe the forward progress wasn't there, but I felt like it was. And then he throws up a Hail Mary to get a touchdown. So he started out the game pretty good, but then it got out of hand, and he, he completes that crap. So 20 seconds left. I'm not going to be able to score again. I think I'm just going to run one more pass play and get this game over with. But look at this. Look at this flood of the zone. Like, dot. That's what you're going to get from this pistol formation. Definitely going to want to check that out at MadnaTips.tv. I'll leave a link in the description below. Look at that. 307 yards passing. Woo! Tom Brady dots on dots on dots. Anyways, this is Route Combo. Hope you enjoyed. And go to MadnaTurf.com for tips, strategy guides, eBooks. Or even just say hey in the chat box if you have any questions. We're more than happy to answer those. And I'll see you on the sticks.